Hi, this is Cindy from Cindy Loves Jewelry. Uh, welcome to my channel. And I just want to um, say thanks for stopping by. If you're not already subscribed, please subscribe and also hit the bell so you'll be notified, hopefully, of when I go live. Sometimes that doesn't always happen, but hopefully you will get a notification. So today, I just wanted to share with you, you remember a few weeks back, I told you that Walmart was clearing out their jewelry counter and that they were clearing some stuff out. Well, the prices have gone down and they've sold a lot. And I hit the silver today. I paid 2 to $3 a pair for these earrings. Most of them were originally $15 to $12. 12 to 15 dollars should say that in right order except for i bought this one pair of earrings well this one box here everything else is stern silver some of it is 18 karat over stern silver but this here is 10 karat gold and the standard cubic zirconias it was originally 38 dollars and i paid seven dollars for it and i don't want to focus real good but there's two pairs of earrings. I paid seven dollars, so three fifty a pair, and they are sterling. I mean, they are ten karat gold. So I don't know what I'm going to do with those yet. I haven't made up my mind. So I'm going to show you some of the other ones I got. And these are stern silver, but they they have a gold wash on them. Originally, I'm trying to make sure it focuses. I don't want to focus real good originally fifteen dollars you can see there just a pair of silver hoops these here are another pair of silver hoops with a gold wash there that's a little better originally fifteen dollars These here are real pretty. They are 18 karat gold plated and they're sterling silver earrings. So let's just see if it seems like when I get them back here, have a little bit, you can see a little bit more. Let's see if I can get a little closer. They have some really pretty uh, cut detail in them. They're teeny tiny. I mean, the in comparison to a nail, they're they're teeny tiny so anyway not teeny teeny tiny but they're small so that's three pairs i showed you the gold ones already uh, this one is a pair of 18 karat gold plated over sterling silver and it is gold tone silver tone and rose gold tone and they're real pretty they have hearts and they were originally 15 dollars also and these were made in jordan uh, made in Jordan, made in Dominican Republic, the other ones, I'm looking, made in Dominican Republic, so this pair, the, these, this pair here was made in Jordan, this pair here also was made in Jordan, and there's another one, if not two pairs of that one, let's see, yep, there's another one of that pair, and they were there you go made in jordan 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 mm -hmm. these here are very similar in fact they're the exact same earring as that other but it's just a gold tone wash and uh, let's see there we go they're made in the dominican republic but these exact same earring just, well it's a little bit different isn't it a little bit different made in jordan so so two made in jordans three made in jordans three made in the dominican republic these here are sterling silver and 10 karat gold plate and they are brilliant cut to look like and they too were made in Jordan there you go you can see 
that brilliant cut it looks like rhinestones but it's actually the silver Uh, another pair of those gold ones they were originally 15 just the heart let's see if I can get it to be still and focus. made in the Dominican Republic and these are a rose tone gold tone uh, no silver tone really showing, but they're sterling silver, 18 karat gold plated. They were made in Jordan, and they're really pretty. Let's see. There we go. It's like it don't want to focus when I get it really close up here. And you'd think the closer I got, it would want to focus. But it doesn't. And then there's a little better. There. Anyway, they're made in Jordan also. So I have 10 boxes, um, 11 pairs of earrings. So I'm ask you guys' opinion. What do you think I should do? Should I put them on Posh? Should I put them on eBay? Should I put them in my auctions? Leave a comment and tell me what you think I should do with these. So, how I should sell them. So, anyway, I actually had thought about keeping some of them for gifts. And I may still do that. But, uh, um, I'd be very interested in what y'all think. So, and don't forget I have the video up today for a uh, flash sale. And uh, nobody's bought any of those things. So, if you're interested... I will be showing them again. I'm going to actually take some pictures and post them on that page so you can see and put the prices on them too. So anyway, so thanks for watching and y'all have a wonderful weekend. Be blessed and stay dry.